The trains are quiet this morning. No scampering for seats or incessant 200 BPM drivel pounding from a ginnet's ear. No loud as you like telephone conversations about completely nothing. What they had for dinner last night and what they're gonna have for dinner tonight. And your one, that old slut, who ran off with our fella and tricked him into being happy. Each stupid, annoying syllable like feeding frenzy fish inside my ear. In the town where I had sought everything I lacked, I now seek all the things I never had back. And so off we go, this all-conquering workforce kept balance beaming on the cutting edge with these courtesy newspapers. Who says the truth don't come for free? Don't believe them. The rough wind shakes, but the good ship bills to pay remains on course, and I stand amongst men sick in the face with their own ignorance. Sometimes I swear to God, man, I think I'm going to burst into song just to annoy the whole bloody carriage just to see if I can get some other unhappy prick to join in. Oklahoma, when the wind comes beating down the plains and the waving wheat can sure smell sweet when the wind blows right behind the rain. Just like old times. (laughs) But in truth, it's not this place that's changed. Our shrugged its shoulders to the gates of dawn. And why should it? All run sealed up with curtains drawn boozers and their Stanley Blade charm. Tall, pale businessmen discussing fiscal policy with spectacle pushing old women in dire need of a kickstart or someone to jump their bones inside this broadsheet masquerade. The salt of their earth, like dust from the devil's mouth. But me, poor, poor me. You know, I've changed my spots more times than a leopard in a psych ward. All tarted up in scruffy glamour and po-faced posturing. For pity or for pity's sake. I've paved my path and blazed my trail to drift as deluge in this dirty river. But perhaps I've changed for good. I smell the air. I see the birds. I long for home and all its trappings. I see this place for what it is. A friend too popular to care. And why should it? What had I cared for? It's feelings. You must be joking. I had seen it as a cow to be milked. A guaranteed fuck. A host to my whims and played the parasite, willfully aloof and windswept. And I now, a 30 year old man, with hope in my heart but doubt in my mind, in a city that's seen it all before. Just like all the rest, one smart aleck comment away from making the wrong person flip and one smart aleck comment away from making the right person smile. And I'll take those odds every single time, because at least there's a thrill in the absurdity of chance. So come on people, we can do it, we can do it. We're all in this together, this struggle, this joy. The universal spirit that bonds us all. Modern bombs don't tick. They just go. Boom.